hey welcome or welcome back to my channel my name is taylor and this is taylor budgets so as you can see by the title of this video your girl got some extra cash <laughs> So I will be stuffing the sinking funds that I wasn't able to stuff my last paycheck, which was the last paycheck in February. So just a quick story. If you're new to my channel, a few videos back, I spoke about how I do not have my car right now because my brother's car is in the shop. And since he has to get to and from work every day and I work from home, he has my car. So he is paying for gas, he is paying for e-pass, which is tolls, and he is also paying my car payment. Now, for the month of February, he only used my car for half the month. So he is only giving me half of my car payment, which is $186. Now going forward, he's going to have to pay the full car payment, but for the month of February, he had only had to pay $186.50, but in total, I am cash stuffing $200 because he also ran some tolls on my car, so he's paying me back for the tolls as well. So, if you haven't guessed already, I am stuffing $200, which is a blessing and which is so amazing because my car payment is $373 and since I work part-time I do have a fairly low income which means that when my pay well which means that when my car payment is due that takes up half of my paycheck so it's just a blessing that my brother is able to pay me back for my car because now I can use it to fund some of my savings which we're going to do today so before we get started if you're new please consider subscribing i would love to have you join the fam and it's free so who doesn't love free right all right so let's get started so this is just a notebook that i have to write down anything and everything that i need in regards to my budgeting journey so right here i received this 200 dollars on march 5th so I have it written here, the total is 200, and I'm gonna write down my allocation right here. I have already written it down beforehand just so this video goes a little bit more smoothly. So let's go ahead and do that now. All right, so this is my allocation. So we're gonna go ahead and move this over just so I can see it. And then we're gonna count this money. So we should have $200. Okay, so we have 20, 40, 60, 70, 80, 90, 100. 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 65, 70, 75, 80. 81, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 90, 91, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 99, 200. All right, so we have $200. Let's go ahead and spread this out. and first we're going to start with vacation vacation is getting 33 dollars so that's going to be a 20 a 10 and three ones 
20, 30, 1, 2, 3. So in total, vacation has, let's see. Okay, so in total, vacation has 20, 40, 50, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 59. do not know how much I'm going to save for vacation. Just going to keep piling it up until we figure out where we're going to go. All right, so next is Mother's Day. And Mother's Day, we'll be getting $7. So that is going to be a five and two ones. So in total... Let's see. Mother's Day has 10, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. And I will be saving $60 for Mother's Day. Okay, next is Father's Day, and Father's Day is getting $1. Father's Day now has one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And I'll be saving $40 for Father's Day. All right, next is Christmas, and Christmas is getting $19. That's going to be a 10, a 5, and four ones. Fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen. I will be saving six hundred dollars for Christmas. So let's go ahead and see what we have. Twenty, thirty, thirty-five, forty, forty-five, fifty, one, two, three, four, five, six. Seven fifty-eight. We have a way to go, let's just say. Next we have other holidays. Specifically, I am saving for Easter right now. So Easter is going to get $20 and that's just going to be two tens. Next is home. Home is getting $30, and that's just going to be three tens. 10, 20, 30. So in total, 20, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80. We are moving on up. Moving on up. Okay. Next is car maintenance. Car maintenance is getting $15. So a 10 and a 5. just all different ways okay so we have 20 30 40 45 6 7 8 9 50 1 2 3 4 55 and my old change is usually 65 dollars and that's coming up not very soon but in about two months or so Next is medical. Medical is getting $15. That's going to be a 10 and a 5 as well. So right now we have 
right now in medical, we have 10, 25, 6, 7, 8, 9, 30. Okay, student loans is getting $50. That's going to be two 20s and a 10. 20, 40, 50. And this is my first time stuffing student loans. So I'm excited. If you guys haven't seen my debt confession video, I'll leave it up here in the cards right now. Let's just say mama has a lot of student loans. <laughs> Okay, so next is retirement. Retirement is getting five dollars. So that's just five ones. One, two, three, four, five. My first time stuffing retirement as well. And I have been looking into Roth IRAs, just kind of deciding which company I want to go with, whether it's Fidelity, Betterment. Um, I also saw Shop Charles Shop, I believe it's called, but I think I'm gonna go with Betterment. Let me know down below in the comments if you have a Roth IRA, and if you do, which company did you go with? And lastly, we're stuffing investments. One, two, three, four, five is going in investments. Not, Mama's not too um, savvy when it comes to investments, so. Again, leave below in the comments what investments are you investing in, stocks, all that good stuff. Let me know because a girl needs some help. And I did not write down anything on our trackers, on my trackers, but I will do that after this video. I just wanted to make this video as quick as possible. But that is all. So we in total stuffed two hundred dollars and i am again blessed just to have money to stuff y'all like during this time i'm just happy to be able to stuff okay god is good and he is going to continue to bless us all let me know down below if you need or if you have any prayer requests i would love to pray for you but we're going to go ahead and end this video remember if you're new please consider subscribing and if you're not new and haven't subscribed yet and you just needed a little bit more of a push there's your push go ahead and subscribe it's lit over here and we have a lot of fun i'm just taking you along my debt-free journey also my journey to purchasing my first home for my daughter and i so it is it's great it's fun and i'm just so happy to be a part of this budgeting community but all in all, thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you guys in my next video and love you all. God bless.